Hey, DLL and Bread, what would your reaction be if Apple spent 5% of its cash stockpile to buy Valve, announced built-in Rosetta-like emulation for Steam games on Mac, and announced an Apple iDeck? Uh, disbelief, because I actually think that Valve is probably worth a lot more than 5% of Apple's cash reserves. See, that's the thing. Valve is a private company. We have no idea except that we know that Valve is a literal money printing machine. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Valve is okay, what is what is Apple's cash reserves right now? Hold on one second. Apple cash reserves. Don't forget that Valve takes 30% of sales. Oh, we know. Yeah, well, we oh, know. Okay. We know. Apple's cash in hand was 62.48 billion dollars. Did you just suggest that Valve could be purchased for around 750 million dollars? Yeah, you better you better add an order of magnitude or two. Valve is we have no idea. That's the thing. But on top of Valve making copious copious amounts of money, their future outlook is outstanding. If I had an opportunity to invest in Valve, I would. Like all conflicts of interest aside, this is not investment advice, blah blah, I'm not a financial advisor, etc. But if I had the opportunity, I would freaking go for it. They have shown time and time again that their moats are un impassable. Uh, Epic Games couldn't do it. Microsoft can't even put a dent in, in Valve's near monopolistic position in PC, PC game sales. And now that Valve is building their own hardware platform around it, holy shit. Um, yeah. People are saying Valve is estimated at 8 billion, but based on what? There's no way. We don't know. There's no way. I guarantee you if they went open suddenly, their valuation would be way higher than that. There's there's like there's actually no way. And and valuation is not as simple as money in money out. That, but that's the other thing. As far as I can tell, their overhead compared to a company like Apple is nothing. Minuscule. Nothing. Yeah. Like, how many people work there? Isn't it like a few hundred people? I don't uh, think we I even know. An, I found an estimate. I don't think we do know. I found an estimation website um, that that thinks there's... Valve believes only 10,000 people around the world are capable of working for the company. I don't know what the hell that means. Um, I found I, an estimation site that said they think it's 350, but I don't think that's based on anything. I found another one that claims 1100. I mean, you might. This is like celebrity net worth articles. Yes. We might as well just play darts again and just mm -hmm. throw darts at a thing and with numbers on it. We might as well make that our estimate. We don't. We don't know unless we work there. And even people who work there, I don't even know if they would know because they obviously do some remote work. Given that Gabe Newell like lives in New Zealand now or whatever, so. Uh, <laughs> There can't be more than three people at Valve because they can't count higher than that. No, 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 that's not right. Because they can't count higher than that, we don't know how many people work at Valve, and neither do they. And yeah, that wouldn't account for any of the contractors that might work with Valve yeah. on projects. Yeah. Um, no, I... Pfft. Nobody knows. I don't, I don't think anyone's buying Valve anytime, anytime soon. I mean, look at the valuation of a company like Epic who can't even figure out how to compete with Valve. Like, what's, what's Epic Games worth? Yeah, they make other stuff, though. Uh, sure, yeah, they've got the engine business, but if Valve felt like having an engine business, I'm sure they could bother with Epic it at some point. They sort of do, right? Uh, Valve? Can't you yeah, use... barely. Uh, Who uses Source? Uh, Titanfall 2 was in Source. Okay, so one game from, like, eight years ago. I don't look into... Games Is Gold Source Games. even out yet? Half Life so, Alex was gold so source. Epic right? Games is valued at thirty two billion. Good. I guarantee you. I give you my personal Linus Tech Tips guarantee that Valve is worth more than Epic Games by at least <sighs> some multiplication factor. Yeah. So okay, so Apex Legends is in source. Um but it's it's really not a good argument because there's <laughs> there's very few other games. <laughs> it's like Titanfall okay. and Apex and then Valve games. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's not very many. Ani Heikage. There are other ones, but no, it's not very many. Ani Heikage in Float Plane Chat says, Valve mostly just wants Source for themselves. The documentation is allegedly horrendous. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Just Valve doing Valve things. You can work on whatever you want. No one ever wants to work on documentation. That's how it goes. <laughs> Jamin 1916 <laughs> says, Valve was valued at $7.7 billion in May 2022 based on Bloomberg calculations. Yeah. But let me tell you a thing. I actually I don't remember if it was Bloomberg or someone else. Maybe it was like Forbes or something. These like reputable sounding publications. Uh, I remember seeing a, like a YouTuber uh, net worth ranking thing or YouTuber earnings ranking thing that I was going through, and I was like, I know some of these people. This is wrong, very wrong. Not even close. Yeah. You have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. And so I reached out. I DM'd the author of the article. I was like, Hey, as someone who you know, knows a thing or two about this industry, I would be curious to understand your methodology for calculating these. They just straight up didn't reply to me. Of course not, because they don't have a satisfactory reply. I threw a dart at a wall. Yeah, pretty much. So that $7.7 billion, they might as well have actually pulled it out of the thing that they use to this yeah. to light up. Like yeah. it's, yeah. no, forget yeah. it. Um, pretzel parkour and float plane chat. I couldn't agree more. They say, let's put this talk to rest. Valve is worth at least $2. Yeah. Yeah. That, and I mean, here's, here's another thing, guys. Something is worth whatever someone will pay. So we can argue all day about what it's worth. People are going to pay big money for Valve stock if it went public. Twitter, according to the last known purchase price for it, is worth $44 billion. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> that's a clever way of wording that. <laughs> but that's the thing, right? So people can talk all day about what their sealed Super Mario Bros, you know, is worth or whatever, right? But it is only worth whatever the next person will pay for it. We can infer based on previous sales, but we actually don't know the worth of anything until somebody actually forks over money for it. So we could make educated guesses if we had access to their financials or whatever else. But even then, we wouldn't know because, like I said, I think Valve's outlook is extremely positive. I think they're nowhere near done growing. I don't think gaming is anywhere near done growing. I don't think Valve's capability or potential for broadening their business is anywhere near done growing. If you were like a Disney style corp, yeah, imagine the money printing machine releasing Half Life Three would be. Oh yeah, yep. Like the 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 potentiality, the cinematic universe. Uh, yeah. Team Fortress the movie. Yeah. Team Fortress, I'd go to that. I would too. It'd be awesome. Yeah, it'd be like Barbie movie, but Team Fortress. I I used to watch like. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, That's Portal has Portal has so much potential. Another Portal game. Another, f- another any game they've made except for Artifact. Any but, IP yeah. they own, basically. Except like for if Artifact. you, <laughs> <laughs> if you were to take, if you were to, if you were to take like a, oh man, just, Valve doesn't even participate in like the mobile like whale whale harpooning space. Like, if you were to take Valve IPs, uh, do they? It's not mobile, but I'd say, like, CSGO boxes and... Sure, but it's a completely different market. So, right. You, you could, yeah, you could get more from going from mobile, for sure. I, I'm just I'm just saying, because I knew people... You're right. 100%. Why not both? But, and I agree, but yeah. some people are going to be like... Oh, they didn't, they didn't. So I was just making like sure if the they if they did some made. some mobile like uh, you know uh, how, what's that a tiny if they did like a tiny tower but you build an aperture you know test facility and they included all the typical you know valve trimmings people play the crap out of that yeah that sounds, absolutely that sounds sick I want I I would play that right yeah people would spend copious amounts of money on it oh yeah. So uh, yeah, no. so that that twelve billion whatever it was is just wrong. I yeah. guarantee it. It's completely if, wrong. If Valve was if Valve was valued at twelve billion, I'd just invest everything I have immediately. Yeah. Again, not advice. Blah blah blah. But like, holy crap! Because you know that's hockey sticking. The second people realize how incredibly undervalued it is. 